In this video, we'll be taking a look at 3NBA happening on March 27, 2023, and providing you with free team picks and total picks for each one of those games. So two picks for each game, six picks in total. Welcome back to Cash Out Sports. Let's dive right into it. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe and to click the bell icon to get notified as soon as these videos get released so that you have more time to plan out your bets as we provide these videos on a daily basis. I can guarantee that you'll have all the important information that you'll need on these three NBA games after fully watching this video. One more thing before we start, if you would like to gain access to our best exclusive betting picks to take your sports betting journey to the next level, then check out our Patreon in the link down below where we offer our best bet single picks, best bet parlay picks, and much more. Now let's get started. Phoenix Suns vs. Utah Jazz Phoenix will try to build on its impressive win over Philadelphia when it travels to Utah on Monday night. The Suns lost 6 out of 7 games before notching their 125-105 win against the 76ers on Saturday. Utah is riding a 3-game losing skid following a 121-113 loss at Sacramento on Saturday. Looking at the betting trends, the Suns are 0-4 against the spread in their last 4 road games, 9-4 against the spread in their last 13 games against against a team with a losing record and 1-7 against the spread in their last eight games overall. The Jazz are 1-4-1 to to against the spread in their last six home games, 6-1-2 to to against the spread in their last nine games against a team with a winning record and 7-2 to against the spread in their last nine games overall. Head-to-head, -head, the under is 7-3 in the last 10 meetings in Utah and the Suns are 4-1 to against the spread in the last five meetings in Utah. The Suns are still missing Kevin Durant, but they should have Deander Iden back in the lineup, while the Jazz are still missing George Jordan Clarkson, Ruddy Gay and Colin Sexton while Lori Markanen is listed as questionable. A big game for both teams in terms of playoff positioning, but the Phoenix Suns are easily the more trustworthy side. The Utah Jazz look like a team that's running out of gas, and that includes losing their last five games by an average of eight points while not playing a lick of defense. The Suns were really struggling during their worst slump of the season before they snapped out of it with a nice win over the 76ers. The Jazz have struggled to keep their heads above water with the injuries piling up and I think those struggles will continue here as the Suns take care of business in this spot. So the Phoenix Suns to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. Utah continues to go over the total at a high rate this season, cashing the over at a 42-29-3 clip, including seven of its last eight games. The Jazz have also gone over in four of their last five home games, using a fast tempo, high-scoring offense, and mediocre defense to play high-octane games. I do not expect that to change on Monday night, as Phoenix has gone over in five straight games in each of its last six road games. The Suns are still playing without Durant, but they have been improving offensively. Utah could get some key players back from injury, which would create some additional value here. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. Philadelphia 76ers vs. Denver Nuggets The Denver Nuggets will be trying to increase their lead in the Western Conference standings when they face the Philadelphia 76ers on Monday night. The Nuggets are coming off a 129-106 win over Milwaukee as three-and-a-half point favorites. The 76ers are coming off a 125-105 loss to Phoenix as one-point underdogs. Denver and Philadelphia split their last 10 meetings. Looking at the betting trends, the 76ers are 5-2 against the spread in their last seven road games, 7-3 against the spread in their last 10 games against a team with a winning record, and 10-4 against the spread in their last 14 games against a team above .600. The Nuggets are 16-6 against the spread in their last 22 home games, 11-4 against the spread in their last 15 games against a team with a winning record, and 4-1 against the spread in their last five games overall. Head-to-head, -head, the under is 6-2 in the last eight meetings overall. The 76ers are 12-4-2 against the spread in the last 18 meetings overall and the 76ers are 13 to 3 against the spread in the last 16 meetings in Denver. The 76ers could be shorthanded here as Joel Embiid and James Harden are both questionable, while the Nuggets are keeping an eye on Michael Porter Jr. who is questionable for this one. The Philadelphia 76ers in the underdog role is attractive given how they've looked all year. However, the Denver Nuggets win at home by an average of 11 points while shooting 52% from the field and they're 24 to 13 against the spread at home. It's hard to step in front of those numbers. The 
76ers were on a roll before they got stopped by the Nuggets on Saturday, but it's always tough to beat the same team twice in a row so I'm expecting the 76ers to bounce back if they have their full squad. However, I'll stick with the Nuggets if the 76ers are missing their two All-Stars. The chalk is reasonable, so the Denver Nuggets to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. The 76ers are averaging 115 points per game and 116 points per game on the road. They averaged 113 points per game in their last three games against the Nuggets. They play at a slow pace, averaging 101.1 possessions per game, and they're facing a team that is giving up 110 points per game at home, so expect them to be held under their average in this game. The Nuggets are averaging 117 points per game and 121 points per game at home. They average 107 points per game in their last three games against the 76ers. They play at a similar pace, averaging 101.6 possessions per game, and they're facing a team that is giving up 112 points per game on the road, so don't expect them to score enough points to push the score past the total. The 76ers and Nuggets played under the total in two of their last three meetings. Under the projected total is our full game total pick. New Orleans Pelicans vs. Portland Trail Blazers The New Orleans Pelicans and the Portland Trail Blazers do battle at the Moda Center on Monday night. Looking at the betting trends, the Pelicans are 8-18 against the spread in their last 26 road games and 4-0 against the spread in their last four games overall. The Trail Blazers are 1-5 against the spread in their last six home games, 4-1 against the spread in their last five games against a team with a losing record and 2-5 against the spread in their last seven games overall. Head Ahead. The under is 6-1 in the last 7 meetings overall and the Pelicans are 9-4 against the spread in the last 13 meetings overall. The Pelicans are shorthanded again as Zion Williamson and Jose Alvarado are both out, while the Trail Blazers are still missing Jeremy Grant and Fernie Simons and they are keeping an eye on Damian Lillard who is day-to-day. -day. The Portland Trail Blazers aren't playing well, are without many key players, and they are on the end of a back-to-back. -back. The New Orleans Pelicans are the healthier side, need to keep winning to position themselves better in the playoffs, and they're winning their last five games by an average of 17 points. The Pelicans have been on fire lately and it's no surprise that they've opened as heavy road favorites as the struggling Trail Blazers will struggle again, especially if Lillard doesn't suit up. The Pelicans are 9-4 against the spread in the last 13 meetings overall and I'm backing them to build on that trend in this spot. Lots of points for a road team, but the Pelicans should win this comfortably. I'll lay the chalk, as this is a tough spot for the banged-up Trail Blazers. So the New Orleans Pelicans to win and cover the spread as favorites is our full game side pick. These teams went over the total the last time they met, but that stopped a trend of six straight games where the teams went under. However, the teams have combined to go over 230 points in the last two games. New Orleans has scored at least 115 points during the four-game winning streak. Portland has been struggling offensively lately, but this is still a team capable of scoring above 120 as Utah learned last Wednesday. Portland has gone over in six of their last seven games and has gone over in seven of their last ten at home. Over the projected total is our full game total pick. That's all for now, so if you have any other games you would like reviewed, then leave a comment down below with the game you would like analyzed, subscribe to our channel, leave a like on this video, and we'll get to it as soon as we possibly can. We would also love to hear your opinion on the picks presented to you in this video, whether you agree or disagree with them, so leave a comment down below and do let us know.